what time of the day it is. It's happy birthday time. It's the Hobbs birthday. And I want you to welcome the Hobbs and say happy, happy birthday. birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Michael. Happy birthday to you. Well, thank you, baby. Mm. I think that was sweet. Was that it was. sweet? It was super sweet. <laughs> well, you have a good DT haul. Happy birthday to the hubs. Anyways. Love you. Thank good you. evening, my friends and my family. And happy birthday to the hubs once more. How y'all doing? You didn't know I was going to do that little ditty. You didn't know you were a part of that happy birthday spiel. I welcome the happy birthday comments down below if you'd like to wish them a happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to the hubs. And if it's anybody else's birthday, happy birthday. I know it's stuff. It's Stephanie Hamilton's birthday. And happy birthday to her. And I'd like to sing her a little happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, beautiful Stephanie. Happy birthday to you. Girlfriend moved into her new place. I'm so happy for her, her and her kids. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. God's got your back, girl. No worries. So anyways, um, what did we do today? Went for lunch with our friends Dave and Lisa. And had a beautiful lunch at this place called Pete's Tavern, and it was delish. Went to the DT for a minute, took him home, and took a nice long nap. Then I got up, and I met my friend, and then I had a couple drinks of alcohol. No, it wasn't. It was iced tea. And then I came home, took another nap. And then I'm doing my DT haul with all you guys. It's Lisa's Crazy World. Woo! You know me. I've got to be a little in that. So, I don't know what else is going on. What's going on with you guys? What's the 411 where you're at? Or what's the high and what's the low? My high today would be it's the hub's birthday. My low is my pain level is through the roof and it's got to go bye-bye. So, I don't know. We're trying to, I don't know. We're trying to figure that out. So, yeah. And then I'm working on, um, Mike's going to probably, I don't know if it'd be, he'd call a narrator or what. We're going to do a, a thing on my sepsis and a thing on my weight loss journey. So be looking forward to that. And he's going to help me because we're trying to figure out how to do this. And I think what we're going to do is just have him come up with whatever questions. And I guess I'll put that out to you guys. Questions. Do you have What questions do you have for us that would be regarding my sepsis and or my weight loss journey? Remember, I had gastric bypass in 2012. So, it was very successful, and then I got sick, and then I was unsuccessful in getting back all my weight. That super sucks. But anyways, um, so if there's any questions, random, random, we don't care what they are, questions, anything from my hospital stay to my care to what they had to do to me, what, how long... Anything and everything you guys want to ask, and then what we'll do is we'll write them all down, and that'll be part of the questionnaire part. Because I have to, have, you know, I can't, I mean, I can talk, obviously, but it's just sometimes it's helpful to have other questions. So, there you go. So, with that being said, I think I would like to um, get started in the hall, y'all. It's not a big hall, it's just a little hall, but it is a DT hall. Hallelujah, hallelujah. So, I was out of, and this is just random, you guys. It's nothing spectacular because DT hasn't anything spectacular. I'm kind of sort of bummed at DT that they don't have more. I mean, I realize we're just coming off Easter, but we got Mother's Day going on. We have summer going on. Fourth of July is coming. I mean, all of these great holidays and things are happening. Plus, 
if it were me and I was running DT, and let me tell you what, if I was running DT, woohoo! Um, the big boom is those fairy gardens. That's huge. I'd get myself as much fairy garden stuff as I could possibly get my hands on. Just saying. So, the other thing I'm looking for and haven't been able to find is that uh, Arm & Hammer spray powder. Has anybody gotten that? If they have, do you like it? Comment down below and let me know. So, with that being said, I got had to get some bags. And this is um, 20 Glad bags. I like this. I, we use these a lot. So we're happy with them. Then Mike went and bought these. I need these like I need whole head, but Kylie may like some. That's the excuse that we use. Yes. Then this is another repeat. Mike likes this. This is a 59 fluid ounce Arizona iced tea. He likes this. This is the big boy. Big like Kylie Mae's apple juice. Big. So he rather enjoys that. I'm drinking my coffee. Mm. I'm also looking for the four coffee cups. The latte, the cappuccino. Something about coffee tastes better with a friend or something like that. And then there's another one. Looking for those. So then I got um, the Scotties with the kittens in the box. Y'all remember that one, the grandsons? Still the funniest thing ever. Got two boxes of those because Mike's got a cold. And when Mike has a cold, he goes through the... Oh, did you guys hear that? Or feel that? It was an earthquake. No, I'm just kidding. I just threw... had to get some more of this because we use this a lot and this is a select a size so you can get one two or three different sizes hell you get the whole roll who cares big find of the day quilted northern northern double rolls i picked up seven packs i may even go back tomorrow and see if there's more if there's more i'm going to buy more because this is a really good deal. This is like three fifty-four bucks for this in the stores here. So yeah, had to get that. Um, might pick this up for our dinner tomorrow. This is the TGIF's Friday sour cream mashed potatoes. Comes with a crunchy onion topping. I probably won't put that on mine. I'll put it on Mike's part because I don't like crunchies in my mashed potatoes. The only crunchy thing I like in my mashed potatoes is corn. That's it. That's all. It's a weird thing, I know, but... So, get yourself some. I think this is going to be really delicious. I do. So... Anyways, um... If you're wondering why I do that on occasion throughout my video, have you guys figured that out, why I do that? Why I go like this? Because I have to have a thumbnail. That's why I do that weird stuff. Yes, I'm just being weird. Wouldn't be a DT haul if Lisa wasn't weird. Just saying. Hello. Here, that's much better. Now I'm centered. Half this video is done uncentered. Love these little bags because then I can get variety. And um, I like the... this. I'm kind of hooked on the uh, toaster crunch. Cinnamon toast crunch. Got two of those. And then, new to my Dollar Tree, um, they had the Eyebrow Lifter and Filler. And I think my friend Anna from Only My Dreams hauled this. Anna, if you could tell me how to do this, that would be really great. Because I'm not really sure. And then they finally had an Ivory Flawless Face Powder. I'm going to stick that in my purse for the emergencies. And then they had this Concealer and Highlighter in Medium Glow. That might be too dark for me. But, you know, for having something new, I was alright with that. And then, of course, I had to break down by the hula girl. I know. I bought her because she's green. I know. I know. I know. Got some more of these. Little bellets. And then Mike noticed that I was out of my little grape jelly and bought me some more. And it's the Welch's. And this is a perfect size. This is a 
9.5 ounce. It's not huge because I don't like it when they get kind of old. I'm not like open and been open for a while. I like this to be fresh so I can, this takes me about a month to go through. Oh, let's see. Oh, this is another great find. This is the Extra Thick and Fudgy 13 by 9 family size. I picked up two of those. That was really a, a good deal. Um, and the date on there is August of 19, so a whole another year and a half away. So I may have to go buy me some more of those because that's a really quite a good deal. And, and some, we just get tired of cake. I don't know about the rest of you, but we just get tired of cake. So... And then I got these Glade Salad El Can I talk today? No, I can't. Glade Salad Air Fresheners. In the Lavender and Peach Blossom. Mm, can't wait to use one of those. And then it makes good, good, good sense, y'all. Good sense, because that's what the husband always likes to say, is the good sense. So I got two boxes of those. This haul is going by really quick. We're going to be done in a little over, you know, 15, not even 15 minutes. Been looking at this, been looking at this, been looking at this, and I'm like, I really can't use it in a pocket letter, but I can probably make a nice card with it. So, I got that. Because I really love, would love to have these in real life like this. Wouldn't that be pretty? I know who would like that, don't you? You know who would like something like that? It'd be um, Tracy from uh, the Holiday Cookie Diva. Wouldn't you, Trace? You'd love that. You might even already have, have something like that, knowing you. Okay, and then the Cubs bought another box. Like, we have three boxes of these, but it is a good date on them. Eight of 19. Um... I got two things left, guys. Um, my tissue paper. I was running low on that. So I had to get that. And that's a good deal. That's 25 sheets. And then last but not least, I bought another one of these because I'm gifting to a friend. And it's the Hardy Beef Stew. Not Hardy Beef. Lipton Onion Soup Mix. I was looking at the Hardy Beef Stew. I'm losing it, people. I am losing it, but it's got some great deal. Or I, I call it glitz for the night. It has some great recipes. You'd think I've been drinking all night, and I only had two drinks, you guys. That's it. And I had them in a two and a half hour time span. That's it. And that was like three hours ago. <sighs> Can't take Lisa anywhere. I'm telling you right, wait, right now. I just can't. She's just Lulu crazy cuckoo in for Cocoa Puffs. So, that being said, this is the end of the haul, you all. I would like you to like, comment, share, subscribe down below. Hit that bell right there when you want to be notified of upcoming videos. Remember, snail mail. Because everybody likes getting something good in the mail besides that damn bill. I know I do. Do something good for yourself so that you can do something good for somebody else. And above all else, I just want you guys to basically be good. I love you guys so much. Thanks for hanging out with me. Bye.